la vedette, la star, elle se nomme Enable, elle va tenter de réaliser quelque chose qui n'a jamais été réalisé dans l'histoire des courses en France, tenter de remporter un troisième arc de triomphe. Voici la reine Enable qui pose ses sabots sur l'hippodrome de Longchamp. I came from Pakistan. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, in 2006, I was working for the boss John Gosden. My brother, you know, he, my, my big brother, he was working for for the boss, and uh, he, you know, I mean, he spoke to the boss about for, for me, and the boss he sponsored me work permit. Then I came here, you know. I just learned a little bit riding in Pakistan, but when I come here, you know, I was just riding only trotting horses, no cantering, because I was not be able to ride cantering. But the boss gave me lots of chances, and he improved me lots. I know he is a very busy person, but he, I, I just always thanks to him, you know, he always take a time. And uh, after third lot, you know, when the work finished, everybody go home and I was going, I was used to go and take up the pony and he was coming every day to teach me riding. Well, I thanks to my boss, you know, he always helped me. Oh, he was a charming young man. He had ridden a little bit at home, but not very well. And so he's... Uh, very gentle person and very thoughtful and so we gave him the time to learn how to ride and ride properly and he's now the creme de la creme. I think if you are fortunate to look after a filly like her it is going to be a high point of your life unless you're sort of president of uh, France or something, probably there's a lot happening, exciting all the time, but I think for, to look after a filly of her quality and her presence and her achievement that has to be an absolute high point of what is a young man's life. We, I used to ride on babies, but obviously, you know, always, you know, the rider change on babies. Yeah, I go holiday and when I back to holiday when she was three year old and she ran and there was Newbury finished third, uh, then after she ran, uh, and after her yeah, uh, uh, ride start riding, and when and she went Cheshire Rogues, and uh, that I was just a little bit, you know, feeling oh, she, she could be a nice horse. And when she went the Oaks, at oh, that time I was feel so proud because that was my first group one in England when she went the Oaks. And that was fastest Oaks ever, apparently. But you know, that time she already won the King George, and that time she already won the Yorkshire Oaks, Irish Oaks, and the Epsom Oaks. And that time I was confident, you know, she's gonna win the Ark, and she was favorite anyway, you know. And the second time when I came here, I, I mean, I was a little bit nervous, but I, I knew she can do that. And today? I think she can do this, but I'm still a little bit nervous because she's going to make a history. If she wins, she's going to make a history, and which is she already made a history in America. You know, same year, you know, she won the ARC and the Breeders' Cup. And uh, finger crossed today, I think she can do this. They, they, they're very close to each other, as is Frankie de Tori, very close with her. I told them, don't forget that she's meant to be a racehorse. It's not all about uh, petting her. But she's, uh, she's a lovely filly, and she responds to kindness, like most horses respond to kindness, and, 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 and that gentle touch. You, you'll never force a horse to do something they do not want to do. And so, you know, to that extent, she's an assertive personality, and uh, we go along with her. Le Qatar plus de l'Arc de Triomphe, la plus grande course du monde, une édition en 2019 qui s'annonce fantastique avec Enable qui est en quête d'un triplé, un triplé euh, inédit. Le Médoc présente pour le moment en cinquième position avec Enable euh, qui est très dans le signage des animateurs. Le Valdez venant au milieu du peloton, c'est qui est un peu plus loin avec le numéro 1, le Fred King qui euh, passe en bas à l'arrière-garde. Le Valdez est en avant-dernière position et c'est pour le moment le Nathan de Gaulle, comme la marche. 
La fausse ligne droite avec Gaillard qui a toujours le meilleur. Magical librement, qui est deuxième, qui est suivi par Enable, toujours marqué par Sotsas, avec Van Guest qui, de son côté, marque l'effort de Sotsas. La ligne d'arrivée avec Gaillard qui est déjà sollicité. Magical librement d'elle-même, quel avantage dans son sillage, la grande championne. Enable, en tant qu'auditori, qui n'a toujours pas bougé. Sotsas qui est lancé maintenant à l'extérieur. Et puis Japan qui s'annonce à son tour. Enable qui prend l'avantage. Sotsas qui vient maintenant l'attaquer avec Japan qui lutte également pour la victoire. Enable peut-être en route pour le triplé. Mais Sotsas c'est là, les trois ans, les trois ans de l'eau qui sont ça, qui sont là, mais Enable qui a toujours l'avantage. Elle est seule en tête, Enable, elle a le meilleur. Valgas qui se lance maintenant à sa poursuite. Enable côté corde, Valgas à l'extérieur. Enable, Valgas. Est-ce que Valgas va enfin battre Enable Oui, c'est Valgas qui s'impose. Enable, merci champion, et deuxième, ça, ça, troisième. I feel so proud whenever she runs because when I take her racing, everybody wants to see her and because she's a star, you know. And obviously, you know, if you see just now, you know, lots of cameras here. I mean, you feel so proud when you, I mean, lead out her. I mean, you, if you walk along with her, you feel so proud because you, I mean, leading our superstar. I mean, I was a just normal rider. I'm, I know I'm still a normal rider, but she, I mean, I mean, make me so proud because I'm riding the best racehorse in the world. I'm so, I mean, proud when I ride her and I look after her. I'm so lucky, and she do too many things for me. I mean, she done so. I mean, she changed my life. She she bought a house for me, yeah. And I think that's the aim to everyone, you know, buying a house. I mean, she done everything for me. Well, I will be sad and I promise, I mean, I will be sad and I will be cry when she retired because I lose my, I mean, best horse ever I, you know, look after, you know, but she will be, I mean, I will, I will miss her. I think I will be cry. I mean, I, she's so close to me because everybody loves her, you know, and she's so important for me and she's so important for everyone. So you definitely, you know, one, I mean, one thing if you like and if you love one thing and soon is the go, so you definitely miss, you know, these things. 